Welcome to MB Trading's online tutorial series. This presentation covers features related to Forex trading with MB Trading. Before we get started, please take a few minutes to read through our legal disclosures on this slide. This presentation will cover order entry for the Desktop Pro. This presentation covers how to place a threshold triggered order, otherwise known as a TTO order, using the MBT Desktop Pro software for Forex traders. The TTO order is typically used for exit. First what we're going to do is click on a currency pair choose a market order and go long in the position. We're then going to set up a TTO exit strategy. We will click on TTO order from our drop down or you can right click on the order entry panel and choose template TTO. This will bring you to the TTO screen. A TTO allows you to set up a stop on one side of your trade and a take profit on the other. You're going to enter the corresponding number of lots. Under action, if you're long, you're going to click on sell because you want to exit the trade with a sell. Right here, it will give you a little bit of information, the position, your basis, and then you will see the option to set up a take profit and a stop loss level. Now these two levels are not random. If you right click and go to preferences, under TTO offset prefill, auto trigger relative to basis when possible, you will see the option here to set up a fixed amount of pips for your target and your stop, or you can choose a percentage or percentage of the average true range. Or you can enter in your take profit and your stop loss manually by typing into the field. Once you have typed in your take profit and your stop loss, you will then click on the submit button. And you will be able to see your open order in the open orders window. As you can see, we have a sell on the Euro USD. One lot is a TTO with a stop price of 133 and a take profit of 135 which either of these values are hit first is where you will be taken out of the trade. You also have the option to adjust this by right clicking and selecting on change order. This allows you a quick convenient way to change your lower trigger and your upper trigger. You also can right click and cancel out the trade. You also can set up a TTO for a short position. For example, if we were to go short in the market and then from our drop down select on TTO, we would enter in the corresponding number of lots. Under action, we would choose buy, which will designate as cover. And if you notice, your stop loss and take profit are now reversed. You can set up your stop loss manually or use your preference and then you can set up your take profit. When you have the two values set, you will then click on submit and you will see the trade order populate in your open order screen. As you can see, we have a buy on the Euro USD, one lot with a TTO, a stop price of 135 and a take profit of 133. Again, you can change this order or you can cancel it out. You also have the option to cancel the order and close your position by right clicking on the position and choosing cancel and close your USD in the account. You also have the option to set up a triggered TTO. For example, if we are now long in the position, we can set up our take profit and then set up our stop loss 
or we can click off trailing offset. As you can see here, we've clicked off a trailing offset and this will give you a point where instead of becoming a take profit, your take profit level becomes a trigger profit trail. So when it hits this level of 135, it will become a 10 pip trailing stop. Or you can simply stay with a basic take profit and stop loss. The next video will detail our combination orders.